Hello my soccer universe. I'm wearing my Chelsea away jersey not only because I really want Chelsea to win this Europa League because it's very good for my team Lusk who actually and this is the weirdest thing played on uh, Thursday afternoon a friendly a secret friendly at Arsenal and how they came to the idea to do this I really do not know because Lask has a vested interest that Chelsea wins that one so you know we don't know anything because it was all about silence but we all we definitely said at work it would have been good if they would have tackled Obama Young a little bit rougher maybe you know knee, knee height that would be good no, but the uh, main reason I want to wear a jersey that provides some contrast to the wonderful jersey that I'm going to show. Um, Saturday evening is the Copa del Rey final between Barcelona and Valencia. And you have seen all my Barca jerseys, two of which are hanging here. The, of course, the 10-11 one and then the 16-17, the Remontada jersey. But without a sponsor uh are hanging right here so i'm showing you my only valencia jersey but this is only it's probably at the moment one of my absolute favorite jerseys and yes uh i am almost ready to flip the page over to national teams i think we have i actually like it in the fall better when you have a little bit of club teams and a little bit of national teams now it's we had this short national team break and now it's just a poor slog i mean i understand why they do it but it was pretty much two straight months only club soccer it's time to get some national team stuff going but back to the Valencia jersey. This is the 1516 Valencia away jersey. And yes, I am in love with this one. The colors on this one are just wonderful. I always like the uh, flag jersey. I think Senyera. I always get this wrong. Um, this, I think it's called Senyera jersey uh, for the Catalan flag. Which of course is the Valencia flag as well, except they have blue on on the side, uh, blue with some yellow pattern, uh, and that's exactly what we get here. This is made after the flag. The only thing that it is missing is that we have only two red stripes here, the real one, and the current currently they put out another one that actually I'm not even sure if it looks better, but it looks more classic. Has the four red stripes, so it's a little bit more of a flag jersey. In that sense, it does look better. But I honestly have to say, I like the boldness of this shirt. This is beautifully done. Um, I like the color combination, especially how the yellow and the blue are here on the shoulders. Then look at the color with the dotted pattern. So there's this kind of mesh where the material from below can shine through. This is an absolute beauty. And then uh, it also fits so well with the Valencia crest. Of course, this is how the flag should look like. And then, you know, some blue on top. So, um, really really loved that one i know that in at work we have a room where a colleague is hanging his uh, jerseys kind of since we are a sports related company and i saw this one and i said this is really the one that i would like to have um and what i like with this one also is that it comes without a sponsor yes you can buy the sponsor but it's on the it should be on the back uh but i don't have it and i'm very happy, happy about that on the back of course i got it only with feguli uh not that i have anything for or against feguli but that was the only way i could get it in my size this is l uh so yeah why not it actually looks quite good with the number two uh the number fits nicely the blue and you know with the yellow outline here on the yellow stripe i mean it's uh, getting a little bit too many yellows in there and that's maybe the one downside of this shirt look close the front the yellow is a little bit going into light orange and then you have the side panels and the sleeves are this bright lemony yellow i really wish that the yellows would be of the same shade the reds are roughly of the same shade the uh, the blue is uh, there's only one shade of blue but the yellows are in, come in two shades and that's the only, only downside. And it's especially uh, weird when you look at the side panels. 
so on the side you have here the front and the back have this kind of more orangey yellow and then it goes into bright yellow that's maybe the really the only drawback so i always say a perfect jersey has three colors this one actually has four colors um, and i'm not taking the crest into account but everything else about this one i absolutely love i even love the weird adidas template here where the blue shoulders go down here it gives it just character and then you have the yellow sleeve the sleeve curve similarly but not the same as above so here we have the blue mesh on the red here we have red mesh on the blue it's also on the bottom the same thing red mesh on the blue it's just beautifully done i know that this the first time i saw it was on the northern ireland and wales shirts of uh around that time yeah and you know when i see watch valencia i see many people in this shirt um this is probably the most beloved Valencia shirt. And I always said, uh, while Valencia plays in white and they will play the Copa del Rey final in white, although, please indulge me. I would love to see this. I absolutely would love to see this. This would look gorgeous. Of course, we have the problem that Valencia plays here with blue shirts and Barcelona would have blue shirts. Well. If they would, they have a red short, so it would have even worked there. That would be absolutely fantastic if they would play this way. And um, they're not gonna do that. Even if you play with the yellow shorts here, this could work. But yeah, as I said, I more or less like almost everything except for the two yellows. That's the only thing that looks weird. Other than that, this is a fantastic shirt. This is a great job of Adidas, and they just use a template more or less that they had uh the only real downside of this one is that valencia was horrible in that season i remember they played in the uh europa league where they beat i think rapid in the round of 32 10 nil on aggregate but that was the only this was the time when neville was the coach i think um was not a good time for valencia but it has one of the best shirts that valencia ever had um, yes, the classic Valencia uh, jer jersey looks slightly different, less uh, templated, the classic Sinera jersey. But I, I really think, to me, I know it's not the classic look, but to me this looks better. It looks bolder. Absolutely. Totally love it. This was high on my list to get it, and I was actually happy to find on classic football shirts. I think I paid 40 pounds for it or something like that. Um, I think the price is okay. I really wanted to have this one, now I have it. And I've been wearing it regularly. A colleague of mine thinks it looks like a Romania shirt. Even if it did, I don't care. Romania should wear something like this. We should all. I mean, you have all the three main colors. What's not to like? Yes, it's a little bit loud, but anyway. I don't know if you share my enthusiasm for this shirt. Uh, I have to say my girls like it and my wife like it too. So uh, that's always a good indication. But anyway, let me know what you think about this beauty. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. And yeah, I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that might be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates on my channel, all things My Soccer Universe. And with that, I want to wish you a wonderful day.